Liverpool hope they can add the UEFA Cup to the Worthington Cup they've already won this season. Their first trophy under Gerard Houllier and their first in five years. Against Derby, they were up against a side growing in confidence and now pulling away from relegation. Nine minutes gone and Dion Burton gave Derby the lead in an orthodox fashion to further ease pressure at the bottom. For the Rams, a sigh of relief. Liverpool's European success means they have games in hand on teams above them. This season, they're beginning to fire on all cylinders. Carragher just a whisker away. With Heskey, Owen and Littman and all in Liverpool's starting lineup, there was plenty of goal-scoring potential. Oh, not forgetting Gary McAllister. Derby's defenders would have a busy day. Gerard Houllier's men had only lost once at Anfield in the Premiership all season, and that was to Ipswich. Surely Derby wouldn't inflict defeat number two. Heskey's had a easy enough for Oaks. Derby began the day seven points above the relegation zone. Burton came mighty close to making it 2-0. But Liverpool came out in the second half as they'd left off in the first. It was attack, attack, attack. Michael Owen tucked away the rebound after Littmanen's cross. Owen's 15th goal of the season. Derby were under pressure. Littmanen picked out Owen once again. Owen was proving quite a handful. As Liverpool pressed for the lead, Derby's defence was stretched to the very limit. Now that's what you call a goal mouth scramble. A few more grey hairs for Colin Todd, I think. A win for Liverpool could put them just a point behind third place Dipswich. Owen was popping up everywhere. This time, beautifully picked out by Gerrard. Derby were hanging on for their lives, but if Owen was closed last time, then what about this? England could certainly do with Owen that sharp against Finland. With nine minutes to go, Derby introduced new loan signing tour to Gudjonsson, and the man from Iceland had the chance to win it. But the spoils were shared. 